Panic, confusion, and carnage. Tonight, Las Vegas police have released the most terrifying video yet of the music festival massacre. 58 people died in the attack. Half were from Southern California. A video captures the terror in greater intensity than we've ever seen before. But it also documents heroism and compassion as first responders and survivors risk their own lives to help others. Tonight, KCAL 9's Suzanne Marquez is here with the video and the story behind it. Suzanne? Jeff and Susie, you're about to see some of the most terrifying and graphic videos of the massacre. It's the sixth batch of videos and other evidence police released in the wake of the deadly attack at the Country Music Festival. Police body cam video shows the chaos that ensued when the shooting began. Get down, get down. Get down, get down. With bullets still flying. I have him shot in the back of the head right here. Officers began tending to the most seriously wounded. It's okay, I gotta keep that pressure, okay. sweetheart. Someone needs to get him to a hospital. While first responders looked for more victims. Did you get everybody out and down there? No, there's a bunch of people in there. People packed into ambulances. Get it, get it. Then even their own cruisers. Oh, uh, we can put another one in there. Oh, I'm a UMT with a female with a gunshot wound to the head. Keep her neck stable. Police arrived on scene and started arming themselves. Many still didn't know where the shooter was. Go kill this mother. They followed the gunfire to the Mandalay Bay. Breach, breach, breach. Inside, police searched floor by floor until they found the room where gunman Stephen Paddock had killed himself, surrounded by an arsenal. Las Vegas police began releasing the body cam video and other information after media organizations sued for access to it. There are hundreds of hours of video, and authorities plan to release more of it in the future. Susie, back to you.